Why should I allow my child to be on social media? I was faced with this question when my eight-year-old asked me if she could have a YouTube channel this past year. This one simple question has led me on a journey that considers both the negative and the positive side of social media. In the previous video, we looked at five concerns for our kids on social media and discussed what we can do in those situations. In this video, we will flip the script and discuss three benefits social media can have on kids in today's world. Hi, I'm Rachel Shell, a mom, business owner, professional speaker, and consultant. For the past couple of years, social media has been a necessary tool for my job and my business. And then my daughter turned eight, and now she wants to be on TikTok and have an Instagram account which has me looking at social media in a completely different way. In today's video, let's take a look at social media and ask, can our kids benefit from social media? Many parents that I have spoken with all seem to understand one thing. It's impossible to keep our children from social media in today's world. Even in school, students may use YouTube or other social media platforms as part of their learning. If you're considering allowing your child on social media, the first thing we need to be aware of is that most social media sites require that the account holder is at least 13. However, these sites do allow children to, par to participate with a parent or guardian as young as eight. Each site has different guidelines, so check with the specific social media site to find out the minimum age requirements. Regardless of what the guidelines may say, there are multiple factors to consider to determine if you should allow your child to be on social media. Family Zone writes, it goes just beyond age. The real issue is not a child's chronological age, but their maturity level. That's something virtually every expert in the field agrees on. So when it comes to determining if your child should be on social media or not, the deciding factor is you. If you decide to allow your child to have a social media account, there are a variety of ways you can go. You can allow your child to use your social media account. This means you can both have the same account and you can use it together. You can open an account for your child and you both have access to that account. Or if your child is old enough, according to the social media platform rules and guidelines, you can allow your child to have his or her own account. However you decide to let your child participate on social media, experts all suggest there is one thing we can do to protect our children, and that is to be involved in their social media experiences. So if you find yourself at the point where your child is ready to be on social media, here are some of the benefits that social media may offer. Social media benefit number one, new ways of learning. Everyone learns differently. Sometimes having something explained to us once is all we need, and sometimes we need to hear something multiple times. Or sometimes we learn best when discussing with others. Social media can be a platform that allows us to learn topics in a way that works best for all of us. A few ways social media is changing how we learn includes the use of micro-learning, collaborative learning, and the application of skills. So micro-learning is about presenting information in a short and focused way. So think about TikTok. This collection of super short videos can teach us anything from a dance routine to how to solve a math problem or how to write a really creative fun story all in 30 seconds or less. Collaborative learning is when people come together to learn as a group. Sometimes we learn more from someone else than on our own. Sites like Facebook and Twitter can really demonstrate how collaborative learning can be done. Ongoing conversations and reactions help people to discuss topics and share their thoughts and their insights. However, it's really amazing that people don't even have to be in the same place or have this conversation at the same time. Finally, when children become an active member of social media, in order for them to participate, it will require that they learn certain skills. And that could include learning to communicate, 
learning skills like video production and creating, graphic design, and tech skills, troubleshooting their way through some of the tech problems they will run into. Finally, no matter which platform your child is using, digital literacy is one of the most important skills they will learn. Digital literacy includes exploring and experimenting on social media in a safe manner. This allows your child to build knowledge, skills, communicate with respect, enjoy online activities, and avoid online risk. And each of these skills are going to help our children to excel now and in their future. Social media benefit number two, connecting with others. The second benefit of social media for our kids is that it allows them to connect with others. This may include connecting with friends and family that are close by or far away. Raisingchildren.net, the Australian parenting website, writes that connecting with extended family and friends and taking part in local and global online communities can give your child a sense of connection and belonging. So finding a safe place where children feel like they belong can really help them to thrive and grow. For younger children, between the ages of 6 and 13, social media sites like Kids World provide safe and fully moderated sites where kids can connect with one another. These sites include games, forums, and child safe messengers that allow kids to meet other kids. Although these sites may be geared towards children, it's still a great idea as you, the parent or guardian, to stay involved in their social media use. And this includes being aware of who your child is speaking to, what they are posting, and the amount of time that your child is on social media. My own experience allowing Charlie to connect with others on social media has been very positive. She has an account on Kids World and is able to play games and talk to other kids about the things that she's interested in, which at this time includes creating videos about wolves. She has learned some tips from other kids who also create videos, and some of these kids even sub subscribe to our family YouTube channel. Social media benefit number three, explore the world. Now, more than ever, children can explore our world without leaving their home. They may interact with people, places, and cultures in a way that has never been available before now. Being able to explore allows us all to find a sense of belonging in the world and helps us to determine what is important in our lives. It's very important to me that our family travel and explore as many different places as possible. However, the past couple of years have restricted the amount of travel we have been able to do. Although social media can't replace the real thing, it's been a great way to explore and learn about different parts of the world. Some of our family's favorites include drone footage of the mountains in Sweden on Instagram, watching YouTube videos of swimming in the ocean in the Caribbean, and reading about small town events in Alaska on Facebook. The unexpected part has been that our kids have started to make requests on some of the places that we should visit as a family. As parents, we do need to be aware and proceed with caution when our children participate on social media. But there are some great benefits for our kids when we allow them to explore and participate in a safe manner. The more we can do now to help our kids learn responsible social media use, the more prepared they will be for their college, career, and overall future. But more about that in our final video. Well, what do you think? What benefits do you see in your children's participation on social media? Let me know by going to Facebook or Twitter and posting your answer from your account. Be sure to include hashtag SmackTalkAR so we can continue this conversation online. And talk to you soon.